Good morning and welcome to Soap Lily's Kitchen. This is Allison and Kathy and we are doing a redo today. We recently um, published a video of our lime and coconut milk soap and uh, we got some great feedback from it. So we have taken those comments to heart and we want to give it another shot. And this is actually one of the, this is the last bar we have of that. And no, you can't have it. It's mine. I know. It's, I know. I already took my last bar. <laughs> <laughs> we had serious issues with this. It's, it kind of seized up and I think it was kind of our own fault. Um, we learned a lot and a lot of the comments people left have um, given us a lot of yeah. help. So we're doing the redo. I, we were just going to show you what this looked like the first time. It, we, we tried it. We were going to do a pretty swirl and we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> so, but it, it smells great. And yeah. today we are going to have our redo and we are going to use. We, one of the comments or yeah. several of the comments com, uh, mentioned additives in the milk. And that that may have added to the thickening. So we um, double checked, and yes, there was. How do you pronounce it? Gargum, we gargum. think. It's G U A R. U A R. So I've been saying gargum. Sorry if we're not <laughs> pronouncing it correctly. We were ignorant. So we shopped around until we found a coconut milk that is 100% coconut milk. It um, comes from Thailand, and we got it on Amazon. Yes, we did. Like everything else in the whole world. <laughs> and it is basically 100% coconut milk no preservatives added right there you can see it on the, on the line above my thumb and so we are going to add this in to, to the, the oils, oils which was another suggestion someone made put it in mm -hmm. the oils before the sorry about that yeah before the last so we are going to, to do, do that, that as well and the the fragrance we're using um we did not we chose not to buy any more of the fragrance oil because we are time. yeah because we already had lime and coconut here and basically that's what it was so we are now making our, own. making our own and we are using the coconut from Camden Gray and we are using that's distilled lime uh, essential oil from Brambleberry uh, and our oils are mixed the oils we're using today are olive coconut shea palm and castor and that's the exact recipe we used last time so mm -hmm. we're just doing it a little bit differently now I am I've stirred oh, it yeah, right now. This is a coconut milk straight from Thailand. This one's got 8.75 in it, which it pretty much has 8.80. Yeah. And now we're going to go to 10.7. Basically, we did half. We used half yeah. of the water amount um, to dissolve the lye, and we're using the rest of the water amount for the coconut milk. Oh, man. There we go. 10.75. Yeah. It's uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, should we worry about it? I'm not going to. Okay, I'm not either. Okay. Because I, I, I did the recipe at a low water. Okay. And then we're going to do this. It's nice and creamy looking though. Sure Look is. at that. Makes me thirsty. Yeah, not we'll so much on coconut milk. Alright. So okay. our oils are at 91, 92. 92. Yeah, yeah okay. more yeah. or less. And the, these are at 75. These? <laughs> these? <laughs> All right, so this these, is these coconut milk. And what we learned is you have to have them the same, roughly the same temperature. Yeah, because we don't want to drop the temperature of this and then the yeah, oil. exactly. So, so we're, we're gonna, gonna warm this up a little bit. Yeah. All right, so it's at seventy four. We're just gonna. Warm and this it. is at ninety ninety one. So microwave. Yep. We have our colors ready. And this is green vibrance mixed up from Nurture, and we mixed it in safflower oil. And that really is green vibrance. We just put it in a jar that we already had because it was easier to scoop out. Yeah. <laughs> we usually get the packets like this from them mm -hmm. because they're a little bit cheaper uh, and we're all about cheap. Um, anyway, this frugal. is... Frugal. Yeah, frugal. Winter white, again from Nurture. Uh, it's mixed up. And then we have from Rustic Essentials, um, and we have Aborigine Amber, which is our I mean, coconut brown. And those are our colors. And we're going so our milk is now at milk 95 uh 94.5 whatever so here goes the milk into the oils which are 88 so here we go Ew. Why did you say that? i'm just looking at it on the look at the inside here look you gotta lean over and look it's kind of like whoa that's pretty yeah like an alien landscape. It kind of does, yeah. I'm thinking of that movie of the Martian. <laughs> All right, here we go. And we're going to stick blend it. Yeah. Just stir it with spatula. All right. 
I think we're gonna have to stick blend it because it's okay. it's I like get the oils in the well they're yeah it's like compart see it's like yeah. um what's the word I want separated it's not yeah it's separated all right. Hold on a second, I gotta put that in there. Yeah, that hands. I don't want this to go on my floor. Alrighty. So something's screwy because it's doing it again. So it's just the milk causes it to I thicken guess. up. Because, because it the temperatures up. were yeah. perfect. There's no ingredients that are weird. Maybe we should have done it cooler. I don't know how cool we can do it. Room temperature. Some people set at room temperature. Right. So you get to be the great struggler again. I'm sorry. It's all right. What color was this? White? White. Or is it? It's still in oh, the there bottom. It is. Yeah. Um, so we're putting which one in there? Coconut. Coconut's going in the green and brown, that's the one. I have a bad feeling. Oops, I'm slopping this everywhere. Well, stop it. Messy. I know. Got your other spatula? Yep. Oh, Lord. I mean, it's still so not. we definitely need to improve our milk, cold, our cold processed milk soaps. Something, yeah. Hot process, I've got down. Well, I mean, we're still not 100% as gloppy as we were the first time. All right, now what's your... Great bread. What's going in this one? Um, that's going to be coconut. Coconut's right. going in the brown coconut and Coconut was the white. Which, this is coconut, right? I don't know. You have to sniff it. Yeah. So in here? Half and half, yeah. And in the white? In, no, in the brown. Because we don't know if it's going to discolor. All right. Mm, child, that smells good. I know it does. This may help it a little bit. I mean, I didn't think I'd mixed it that. You didn't. Because usually we're oh, really heavy-handed with the mixer. I know, and I didn't. All right, there's that. That's pretty. This is... Not really big enough for this, no. so I'm gonna do this. This is probably insane, but <laughs> well, I, I just can't. I know you gotta have room to stir. I don't want to waste any of it, but that is a great coconut scent. It smells better it really mixed is. into the soap than it does right out of the bottle. I know. Okay. And then, and then the lime goes in the. This is tiny too. Did you um? See, it's got dots on the top again. Yep. I don't know what those dots are. That's weird. Dot. And there was another one over here. You know what you would be saying to me? What? Hurry up! Hurry up. I know! I know! I know! I know! <laughs> I know! I'm thinking the same thing. I'm like, don't look at the dots. <laughs> Do the stuff. All right. Fredo, go outside. Yeah, he needs to be careful because I think I slopped some of this on the floor. No, that poor, go the squirrel, the squirrel. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Mmm, that smells good too. Yeah, it does. Have you thought about, um, how you want to pour it? No, I haven't thought about <laughs> how I want to pour it. I think what I'm going to try, if it'll pour, is uh, do, you know, like, first I guess I'll do the brown, mm -hmm. and then the green on top of it. Do layers. I, I get, I don't okay. know, I'm, I'm flying blind here. Okay. I was just curious. It's still, it's it's not as good use. It's not as bad as last no. time. No, and what I'm going to do is do lines. Okay. It's, it's like I'm doing some kind of drug or Shh, something. Shh, don't say that. That looks like chocolate batter. I know. I'm just going to go ahead and put it in. Okay. Because we're... No, that's much better than last time. It is. Time. It is much, much better. It isn't what we wanted, but it's... What did we want? I don't know. I'm we pretty happy with it. We wanted to be it. like the spinning swirl. Oh, no. I wasn't even expecting that. Okay. All right. There's that. And then I'm going to do the... 
And it's funny because the vibrant green, it, looks like, it yeah. looks like baby diarrhea ick. But, wait, wait, oh, never mind. What? You're not doing layers. No, I'm just going to do this. Okay. But after it... Um, do a high pour. After it gels, it comes out this beautiful green. Yeah, it really does. It's, it's very pretty. Yeah, we're not going to be all weird about this because we don't have time to be weird. And creative. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, I mean, I'm creative. weird all the time, regardless well, of creative weird. Weird is a state of being. That's right. Here, buddy. Okay, do me a favor, Al, if you can. Never mind. What? Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was lovely. The goggles were all fogged up. I she know. can't see. I she had to make I was it trying so to help, but air. I ended up grabbing her nose. <laughs> That's why my thumb right up her nose. That was really gross. That was gross. <laughs> All right. And then, last but not least, we still, see, we still have a little yeah, bit Yeah, there's of, still some pliability to that. All right, so I'm going to go way up here. Oh, yeah. And see if I can... Higher. You're going lower. I know. All right. Now I've got the... The thing is all slimy. Oh, yeah. Definitely slimy. So we will see. It's much more workable than it was the last time. I have to say that. Yeah. It's not as workable as we kind of wanted it, but... Oh, I'm I'm close to I it. think it's okay. Well, you can still do a little swirling with yeah, that. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to try anyway. All right, I'm going to smack it first. cabinets were not built by people that okay so know, a the, big old swirl okay this kind like this or just, be, I oh I know I wish I had more brown swirling well, I mean, this is truly like like what I don't know that that's really pretty it's a good looking batter yep yeah or just more I am not going to tell you I what to do. Because I can say stop and then you'll say, well, wait, one I more know. spot. I know. I'm just trying to get the the colors mixed. I wish we had more brown. <laughs> but they'll be on the bottom. It'll be yeah, Let me see if I can get a... No, there's no drops. No, there's no drops. So that's it. Oh, and we got to put the thingies in. Yeah, they're right here. Are they... Is this... They're not okay. flipped yet. Yeah. You'll have to turn them over. Okay, this is... Oh, this oh you did not. I did. Well, see, you want more brown showing. So. Well, you know. Turn them back over. Just do this? No, turn those back over. Put it back together. All right, give me my, where's my skewer? I got it. Oh, it's fine. Hey, woman. All right. Oh, my gosh. Kathy, what are you I doing? I don't know. I'm like a goofball today. I can't get it to go. Hold on. One more time. I can't feel it. That's the problem. Kind of angle it. Like this. Yeah. Then get it in place. There you go. Bravo, bravo. Oh. And look, remember last time you were having to stand on your tiptoes and like push. I know, push. so that's good. That's very good. We, we're happy. We are so happy. Okay, there we go. So very So happy. it did thicken up. Not as much as the last time. Mm -hmm. It still was workable. Mm-hmm. We still got a pretty soap. Yes, we and did. It, and actually, if you look at this, how gunky that was, and you see the big corner and stuff, mm -hmm. this is all nice and gorgeous. So. And it's going to be very gorgeous when we unmold it. It is, and I'm hoping I can, it smells it, really good. It is. It's a good blend. It, it is a good blend. Okay. All right, cool. So you can see it um, when we unmold. Yep. Hey, and we're back, and it's now the next day. Yeah. It's been 24 hours. Yeah. And uh, here we go. And, ooh. Lime. Ooh. Lime. lime, but you read, last time we did it, I know it's, it smells lime, lime, and after it cured, it it coconut it calmed down. Coconut it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We hope this will coconut. Okay. Oh, let's hope it comes out in the mold. Is it a little sticky? Yeah, a little bit. Well, we could freeze it. We did put this in the refrigerator for a couple of hours yesterday to keep it from getting too hot. Oops. Look, same oh, thing. Yeah. See. 
Well, I think we need to leave it in there a little longer. Then. Okay. Well, it's pretty. It's very pretty. But it's too, yeah, look, it's too see, I can't. Yeah, it needs to stay a little. All longer. right. So we'll just, we can leave it right in this thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, so so on the, we will um, be back tomorrow. I'm trying to get. Well, Allison, well, I won't. Oh, that's right. I'm, I'm going to. Me. Yeah, You're going where? To south. the beach. Okay. It has been another 24 hours, and Kathy's now at the beach, so I'm trying to unload it. And I have my mom doing um, work as camera lady today. You can say, hey, mom. Hey, mom. <laughs> <laughs> so, yesterday we tried to unmold it, and it was um, a little sticky. It's still kind of sticky today, but I'm going to try anyway. Just because I have other things to do, and I don't want to be unmolding soap again tomorrow. <laughs> I've got to wrap and label soap all day tomorrow. Poop is coming. Can you smell it, Mom? Not yet. You can't? Well, I smelled that when I came in, and my nose is... Oh, see how sticky it still is? See that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm not going to try to take it out, because it'll... It'll mash it apart. Okay, so, there, there we go. It's going to sit for another 24 hours, and we'll try this again tomorrow. Okay, so I'm impatient, and I went ahead and pushed the bar out anyway. And it didn't leave a thumbprint. So I'm going to go ahead and try to unmold them and see how they look. Alright, here comes the next one. Yeah, I'm not leaving fingerprints in it. So they look pretty. How do you like those colors, Mom? I think they're pretty. I have to smooth off the edges a little. I can smell the lime. <clears throat> and I'm still hoping that as this cures, the lime will settle down a little and we'll smell more of the coconut. That's what happened to the last batch. I like the way the color swirled. That's pretty. Let me smell one. What do you smell? I don't know. Let me smell the big <laughs> I think I'm smelling lime. Well, good, because that's one of the... Mm -hmm. Okay. It has lime essential oil in it, and then it has coconut fragrance oil. And then we made it with coconut milk. Mm. So, I have a lot for there to be more coconut, but... Just that lime is so powerful. Oh, I love lime. It might... It makes my jaws tingle. <laughs> you know, if you smell something yeah, real yeah. tart. That's a pretty one. I'll have to smooth that out. But... Okay, I'm What is the dark color? What do you mean? Is it a, like the green is lime and the dark is something else? No, we just use different colors because we like them. Oh, okay. The co we actually colored the coconut fragrance green and brown because mm -hmm. we didn't know it had, if it has vanilla in it it'll discolor the oh. soap and then the part that's not colored is the lime we so got, actually the green is not the lime right <laughs> okay but our scent was not supposed to have vanilla in it so there shouldn't be any discoloration but we just want to take a chance. Yeah. to the smell and we'll have final pictures up next thank you for watching just one quick follow-up before um, the end of the video it's been four weeks since we made this soap this and I um, wanted you to see how the colors have cured we have some really really pretty swirls in this soap so to those of you who left us comments on our last batch and made suggestions. We thank you so much because it certainly, certainly helped um, with this soap. Look at that pretty swirl. I personally would like more of a coconut smell, 
the lime has died down and it's a it's a really nice fresh smell you can smell the coconut I think I'm just gonna have to find a fragrance um, that just suits me everybody else likes it I just wanted more coconut um, it's still a great great smell and I can't wait to use it I might share it I don't know I might not <laughs> but anyway thank you so much for watching and coming up next we'll have some pretty final shots of the soap Thank you.